Welcome back. With Flagstaff being a dog-friendly community, many local volunteer options encompass working with animals. Emily Kane spoke with members of one program in Flagstaff that is setting dogs up for a life-changing career. Coco Pups is a Flagstaff group of volunteer puppy raisers who build the training foundations for future Guide Dogs for the Blind. Coco Pups is comprised of more than a dozen community members passionate about providing freedom to visually impaired people throughout the nation. You do something for someone that you don't know even exists yet, you don't know that they have a need, and then it just comes together and all of a sudden you've raised a puppy dog that allows someone who maybe was homeschooled to go to public school or you've uh, um, raised a puppy dog that allows someone to go to work. It's just, it gives them freedom that they wouldn't otherwise have. Raisers receive young puppies from the nonprofit Guide Dogs for the Blind program and spend approximately one year teaching them obedience, leash behavior, socialization skills, and more. The highs are when your dog is, gra is graduated with a good user, especially one who is going to keep in contact with you. The lows are when you have to take the dog back and say goodbye, no matter which dog it is. The program also positively impacts the local community. Dogs in training raise awareness about service dogs and their contribution to the disabled. Puppy raisers are active in the community by socializing the puppies and many local businesses and holding training outings in various public places throughout Flagstaff. I think that the more people who are involved in the community, the better the community is. So it's a community and family in itself and there's so much support and knowledge in the group. Volunteer puppy raisers around the country are contributing to their local community and are mutually benefited by their work. It helps you meet people, so you communicate with a lot of people about our program, about what we do, and people get excited and are really supportive of us. The group is always welcoming those with an interest in puppy raising, sitting, or just learning more about the program. For NAZ Today, I'm Emily Kane. If you're interested in getting involved with Coco Pups, you can visit their website at www.guidedogs.com or their Facebook page at Flagstaff Coco Pups.